Hello everybody, welcome to Leeds Wine TV. I'm your host Mark Fusco here for another episode. Obi-Wan Ginobili, baby. Opening night tonight, Spurs game. I'll be there. Um, with all this. I'm excited. Anyway, um, we are going to do uh, a wine called Zinfatuation. Now I've seen this here and there. It's uh, from the Trinchero uh, Winery. And uh, it's 2005, got it at World Market for $7.98. And uh, it says Amador County, and I had to look up where that was. It's east of Sacramento. So uh, let's check it out. There's only two vintages of this that I could find, a 2005 and a 2006. So I'm not, I'm not real um, hopeful, to be honest. Uh, that this is going to be any good, especially since I've seen a couple of reviews that gave it not the best score. So we'll see. Maybe uh, maybe it's pretty good this time. All right. So on the nose, uh, I like the nose so far. It, there's kind of uh, there's kind of some uh, chocolatey, like some cocoa, maybe some cherries. So maybe like chocolate covered cherry. And that's pretty much what I'm getting off the nose. <clears throat> Let's see how the palate is. It's um It's not too bad. We're gonna have steak later. This will probably go pretty well with it. I get kind of a smokiness out of it. Kind of a bitterness. Um, tannins are pretty decent. Uh, it's kind of smoky. But other than that, I don't really get much. Uh, it'll probably pair well with the food a lot better. This, this is definitely not a, a wine that I would just sit down and just drink. Um, I think you really need to have some food with it. But um, it, it, it kind of tastes a bit old, and I know I've used that before with, with other wine, um, and that's been a bad thing. And it's not necessarily a bad thing for this, but it's not like it's old in a good way. You know what I mean? Give it an 82, and that's about what I kind of the, the the ratings I've seen. I saw some really low ones too. Um, 82, it's okay. Uh, it's eight dollars. I think you could probably get um, same quality for a little bit less, but you know, it is what it is. I mean, we're, we're talking eight dollars. You know, eight dollar bottle of wine. We're not talking you know a fifty dollar bottle of Zin that's going to be you know knocking my socks off. But you know, hopefully. You know, we find, you know, part of the reason we do the show is to try to find those little gems that are 10 bucks and under. Um, or if you go a little bit higher, like 10 12 $13. <coughs> but this is not one of those gems. So I wouldn't consider it a elite wine uh, for 8 bucks. had a discussion one time about why am I called elite wine when wines are under $10. I'm like, because that's the wines we're looking for. Anyway, it's okay. But... Uh, I don't think I'd get it again. I bought it because of the name and uh, figured that other people would buy it too. And that's another reason. You know, I buy, I buy the wines that <clears throat> I think other people will buy too. And I'll review them. If I like them, cool. I'll let you know to buy it. If I don't like it, then I'll let you know that too. Um, so uh, it's okay. Other than that, let's see what else. we got opening night, like I said. Last night I went to the Watermark Grills VIP event. A uh, bunch of Twitter people were there. Saw all of my Twitter buddies. Um, great time, and I uh, see lots of good things for that restaurant. So if you're in San Antonio and uh, you're looking for a new place to go, uh, I think they open up in a few more days. And uh, I you know, suggest heading out there. It's a nice place. That's going to be it for today. Um, just as always, make sure you <clears throat> click the links, friend me up. Uh, 
send me emails or comments if you uh, you know on the shows and all that kind of stuff. I did meet one of uh, I, did, I did get to meet one of my viewers last night. That was really cool. It's always kind of it's always nice to meet somebody that that um, you know is watching uh, the show. So it helps uh, helps to have that happen. And uh, that's gonna be it. We're gonna do another one in just a second here for Friday, and we'll see everybody again on Friday.